You'll never know what my husband asked me to do this morning. Hey, honey, can we go to Hobby Lobby and look for Christmas decor? I thought you'd never ask. Huh. It was his idea to be here. I'm a new it was his idea. Man. Yes, you are. So we're getting stuff for the store, obviously. Um, and we're looking at bows and stuff. He's taking pictures and sending it to our employee because she's truly the one in charge. <laughs> yes, um, making sure that it looks nice. But I'm seeing stuff. I, we're also going to go to Walmart. But I am loving these um, fake garlands. This one. I don't like, I don't want it to look like, let me see, I don't want like this old school like um, Christmas tree one, but this one looks like really cool and and like nicer, you know what I mean? Like, can you see this little, uh, like the, looks like an actual branch, but even at 60% off, it's still 50 bucks. I'm, I'm not sure. We took pictures of a bunch of stuff. We're sending it to our employee. She's obviously busy at the store and we're not saying her name because we just want to keep her privacy yeah that's fine i haven't asked permission to like keep saying yeah um but she's in charge of decorating so we're kind of trying to get her opinion on whether we should buy certain things we did find these giant jingle bells but they were giant they're huge and if everything truly is 60 percent off with christmas these little giant jingle bells are only like 20 bucks killer deal the giant one is like $80, so then it would be like four, 32 I think, for the giant one. Um, but anyway, I think we should get them, but we're waiting to hear back from her. In the meantime, before we make a decision, we're gonna go down to Walmart, but our Walmart closed down in the city next to us, so we have to go like four cities away <laughs> to get to to get to a Walmart. And he hasn't, you haven't been down there in years. No. He's like, I don't even know where it is, so. I go down because it's like a trifecta of stores because there's a really good dollar store, there's Crumble Cookies, Walmart, Wendy's, and Chick-fil-A. So like, no matter, when I started doing it, no matter who went with me when I had kids that had to go with me shopping, uh, I could appease everyone. I could like, I could go for nuggets at Wendy's, I could go for Chick-fil-A, for Abby, I could go, and everyone was happy and I got Walmart and I got the dollar store in. And uh, anyway, so we're gonna head down. And honestly, like I've talked to dollar store owner, or not like owners and supervisors, and a lot of them model, and they want to do it as good as the dollar store down here, down in Covington, because they're like, I know the Covington Wall or dollar store is the best one. I don't know how they do it it's so good, but I don't think we need to go there today. But we're gonna head to Walmart and see what there. I haven't really shopped Walmart. Christmas decor in a very long time because I just use Hobby Lobby or Target. So. Alright, well, I'm not as impressed with Walmart as I thought I would be. I mean, little stuff is kind of cute. That's actually really cute. I do like that, but the garland I was looking for is literally like rubber. So, you know, like, like this is, you know, like that fake plasticky, but this one is like literally rubber. It's very strange. So, I, we're not having much luck and things are looking better and better priced at Hobby Lobby. So we might just go back there, but we are gonna get a few groceries <laughs> while we're down here, just so I don't have to go to Costco. I forgot to get bread, that's kinda cute. Well, we didn't get any Christmas stuff, but we got a lot of groceries. And it's starting to rain, it's cold. It's like 39 degrees, which is unheard of in November for us to have it that cold. It's not even that cold. Oh, we're right here. But uh, if it keeps staying cold, especially at night, we're going to get snow because we get precipitation all the time. So I can't ever pass up getting Progresso when you're at Walmart because they're only $2 a jar, a can. And then my girls love this, like the fruit, the fruity cream, whatever this is, oatmeal. So there's certain things that I stock up on when I'm down here. Also, the ramen, I don't know if they changed their packaging or if this is a whole new brand. I can't really tell. I hope it's not a knockoff brand. I hope so. It's ramen. I mean, it's not good for you anyway. Also, Costco has not had their double pack 
of this syrup or log cabin, whichever one it is, for like a year. So we got that. And we got a few other like pastas and, oh, I got this. This is the only Christmas thing I got. One of those like wrapping paper cutters. I've always wanted one of those. So I let myself get one of those. We're gonna go get lunch. Cause now we have a long drive to go home. It was kind of disappointing, but it also shows us that Hobby Lobby really was the better place for all the things. But I actually might go to Michael's if we have time because oh my, I still want to find a garland. Last year and well for years I've been making my own out of real greenery. I'm not opposed to that but it would be nice to just not have it making a mess. You know what I mean? Also this is my new sweater from Costco. Kind of fun. All right let's go find okay, some. We're heading home. Do you want to tell them what you just turned on? On the car. This is the auto steer. So it's kind of like autopilot. It's not full autopilot, like it won't recognize stop signs. And But you only have to put your hand on the steering wheel? I just have to keep it gently on there and, and it, it, it's doing it on its, its own. It. And it's made a few gentle turns. It won't do it won't it'll stop for other cars, is my understanding. <laughs> <laughs> we're going well, barely the speed limit no, just to test over. it. We're going six, two miles over the speed limit. I know. Uh, it'll stay in its lane. Oh yeah, with the blue means I gotta grab the steering wheel more. Uh, when it turns blue, you have to hold it more. Yeah, it gives you a warning because it wants to know you're there. Otherwise, it'll turn it off. Oh. Um, like here, there's a turn up here, and the car's gonna make it. it should make it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there it goes. Isn't that crazy? So this is like a major corner turn, and it's doing it. Yeah, it's right? doing it. I just have to keep my hand kind of on the. And wheel. your foot's not on the gas. Oh, I know. My foot's not, hasn't been on the gas for like a while. So it's kind of like cruise control, lane clear, assist. I do that. Oh yeah, so he can even increase the speed, yeah. and then it'll then stay. Yeah, it just goes, I do it with the, the little thing here. So now it's gonna go. You increase the speed with, the hand, with that? With that? knob. That's crazy. Now it's turning. That this is eerie <laughs> as all get out. I have never. We're only practicing it because this road is like, there's no one on it. It's a good highway speed. It's a good way to test it, but there's not very many people on the road. This is gonna be a nice road trip. Could be, it's just so eerie. I gotta get used to it. Yeah. All right, after sitting in our car, watching another movie, waiting for Kaylee to get out of school, in order to take her to PT, we are back at Hobby Lobby. We're gonna go get some balls. <laughs> I will show you. I'm actually really excited to get them. After finding nothing at Walmart, I'm actually very excited to go in and get a couple things. But, um, drop Kaylee off at PT, and hopefully she can set up one more appointment. Her doctor got sick this week and had to cancel both of her appointments. So I'm hoping she can pick one up tomorrow or even Saturday if they're open. Um, so she doesn't get behind on her therapy. And then Jacob's gonna pick her up and take her for, what is my phone doing? To do, um, she's gonna go get Cafe Rio on her way home. And then we'll get home and all our kids will be home from school. So, ready to go. Shop? Yes. Right. I already have balls. Okay, just checking. They're large ones in case you need. Just kidding. <laughs> so they're actually jingle bells. We were joking that they're balls, but. Okay. That's a small one yeah. for size reference. And then those are the big ones. There's another small one. How many do you want? There's a small one. Is that too, is that too big? <laughs> Sorry. I, I, I don't know. I like the idea of one. Don't you have to have everything in threes? You do need to have them in threes, and I do like the size difference of one, and then it's, yeah. So, anyway. And then we're gonna get two of these, and you have gold ribbon or red ribbon? We're doing gold and red. But you're gonna hang these from the big she windows. Has, she has an idea. Things are coming down, presents at the end of ribbons. Uh, the yeah. whole thing? It's, it's gonna be like, It'll be just in the window, it's gonna be like hanging back from the window coming down. Cool. It, she showed some idea pictures. Oh, have her, will you have her send it to me so that I can help her find stuff? Okay. I would love to see the idea. Ooh, wait, no, we're doing gold. No, gold. 
<laughs> Good thing Jason's got some some extra balls in here because he let me get this, and it's sixty percent off. All this is sixty percent off. Yes, it is. So it makes it worth getting. Yes. <laughs> We're saving money, not yeah. spending it. No, I got to think like a woman now. It's not what I spend; it's how much I save. <laughs> That's, it was your idea to start this we today. Have to do this for the store. We do. This is a business expense. I normally would. Well, yeah, these are. This is all for the store. Yes. We are also hosting Thanksgiving, so I got these cute plates, and then I have like wood, um, well, fake wood chargers to put them on. That's for pumpkin pie. And check how deep these are. These are like deep dish plates. That's <laughs> amazing. And then some napkins. All right. It's been a couple of hours. It's now 7 p.m. I have, we've been little tinkering people all afternoon. Uh, I haven't even finished laundry. We've been cleaning. We've got the carpets cleaned. You vacuum for me. Why is your hair wet? Because Jacob was spraying me with water. That's because you gave it to him. No. I was spraying Kaylee, then he got it. Okay, so when we got home, um, Jason and I relaxed for a minute, but then I did this. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. So Jason got a whole bunch of um, little twinkle lights for the store. Oh, I threw the box away already. And so I knew I wanted to put those lights in it, um, but then I realized it's book club tonight. So let me show you what I did. So I took, I think, four strands of lights, or one, two, three. They're just like this. They actually can change colors. Not that I'm going to change it colors. Oh, it's down here. So it can change colors and like different settings. I don't like blinking. I gotta get back on the one that it was on. I think that's what it, and then it dims back down and then it comes back on. So I have all those kind of tucked in behind there. This isn't where it's going to be for Christmas, but I figured it was kind of a nice place to have it while my friends are coming over. I'm gonna try and drape that one. Does that look a little bit better? I do like it. It's a little uneven, but that's kind of what I'm trying to go for, a little organic splay of greenery. Um, but I've kind of put the twinkle lights all up in here. These work a whole lot better than actual Christmas lights because the wire is a whole lot thinner and you don't have to plug it in and have like a cord draping down. So I will put this whole garland here up on our mantle, um, but I have to dust this, take out some of this, put up Christmas ones, that whole thing. So I just didn't want to do that tonight. Um, so I'll fix that. So out here we took down all the cobwebs and the Halloween decorations. There's a few little swags of, of the cotton up there that I couldn't reach. Um, but we took, got it all off of the bushes. I'm turning these to white tonight for my book club friends, but tomorrow I will have to take that outside one down. Our HOA will not be okay with me leaving that one up. And I likely will take these down because I don't like neon white. I don't like bright white. I like warm white when it comes to Christmas colors. Um, but we might turn it to red and put it somewhere else. Maybe do, maybe what we could do is like a red and white candy cane stripe and like wrap it like all the way around that. That might be kind of cute. So I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do with them. I don't know what we're going to do with them for Christmas, but they won't be staying here. Anyway, I think I might close out with you guys tonight. I'm getting kind of hot. Jason's been cleaning the bathrooms for me, and I have been listening to a book on my audio book. And or what are you listening to, like a podcast or? Yes, I am listening to. Maybe the ladies are interested. I am listening to Andrew Huberman from Yale or Harvard talking about how meditation works and science-based effective meditation. Well, if that won't put you to sleep, I don't know what will. <laughs> <laughs> but we're going to sign off. Are you excited about the Christmas stuff you got today? Oh, yeah, yeah. It'll be fun. We'll have to do maybe a video on after the store decoration. Yeah, after she gets it all like decorated and yeah. stuff. She, she's going to... She's got a vision. We're going to put it together. We're going to, you know... Yeah. I know we're just gathering, but... Yeah, no, that's good. So, um... He is off again tomorrow. She made, she's our new store manager and I love her to death because she's like, Jason, why don't you just not go to work today? And he's like, oh, well that sounds fantastic. And so he's, hang on. So I'm gonna end our night. I've gotta convince this one to eat a little bit more so that our kitchen is empty. Um, we are discussing the book Taste by Stanley Tucci. 
and Ashley, don't! I have a camera. She has these water bottles, and she's wondering why people are spraying her. No, because he look at me. Go put them in the bathroom. No more. Yeah. Um, but we were talking about his book, and initially we had planned a book club where people brought food with recipes he talks about in the book, but it's just too last minute. We've already rescheduled this. This is our third time rescheduling it, and we need to just do it because our next book club, technically in November, in two weeks, is to do our book exchange for Christmas and our voting for next year's book list. And hopefully we have a no bunch of new people who want to join um, so that we can actually do it. So I'm gonna sign off with you guys and figure out what <laughs> food, I don't even know what food. I think maybe someone's gonna bring something, I don't know. But if not, I'll, <sighs> maybe I can get Abby to make brownies for me real quick and they can be baking well. Um, we talk about the book and then we'll have a snack. But we're gonna sign off with you guys. Take care and have you started decorating for Christmas? Have you even thought about it? Have you decorated your tree yet? I, I don't know when I'm gonna do everything, but I'm now I have the itch. Having put this out, I have the itch to kind of get going. Also, leave a comment down below since I have a lot of time. Should I flock this? If you remember from last year, if you were with us last year, I started to flock things and I have I a flocking so. spray. I do kind of like it. Maybe just light. It's too much white. It's not staying here. It's going on the mantle. Because okay. well, okay. I don't want too much green in here with the tree. Well, those other things are flocked around it, so you don't need to do it. They're not staying there. He doesn't know how to decorate, which is why I'm so glad that some, but our employee is the one doing it at the store. So I'm going to sign off with you guys. Um, and we'll see you guys next time. But oh, should I flock that? Should I flock it? That's the question. Okay, not even a very, not a ton. I will not flock it like this. Let me show you, let me show you. I'm not gonna like go full bore like this. It'll be a light dusting of snow. And a lot of people last year had never heard of flocking. Have you heard of that before? If you haven't, look it up. Look at my past Christmas videos. Maybe I'll leave that playlist because that's what we're going to start doing here very, very soon within the next week or two because it's all happening. It's all happening. Okay, take care. Good night. Of all the magic places in the world I've been to, this is where my heart is. Oh, you know it's true. No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you